Well, hey. <laughs> Hi, good morning, everybody. It's Kim, your party artist here at my studio, Overholt Art and Entertainment Studio. You want to know a little bit more about me? Check out my website, kimoverholt.com. And I apologize to you guys because right now I have no visuals going on whatsoever. I don't know what's going on with my camera. I don't know what's... <laughs> it's Monday. I guess Monday is full of surprises. And, and, and this is a surprise for me because usually when I get no camera, it usually means that there's something uh, going on. But you know what? I've been having some issues just with visuals period. So let's just bear with me. Okay. Let me just uh, pull up another one just so I can see what I'm doing. And that way I can watch myself and, and help you guys and, and do this right. Okay. So at least I can see myself here and say, Hey, how's it going? Yeah. Okay. So if you haven't checked out my website, kimoverholt.com, I do art, I do, uh, you name it, you name it. You know, I wear so many hats and my sister would say uh, if I told everybody everything that I did, it would probably take like the whole, the whole, <laughs> a whole good half, half an hour or more just to tell you about it. But I wanted to show you, hey, I got some new uh, markers, new dry erase markers, and I wanted to try them out today. So, so that the next time that we get together and do some real cartooning, I can make it a little bit more fun for you with a little bit of color. So we got some colors here. Da, 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 da. <laughs> so there you go. I hope this is showing you guys. I really do. And I apologize. Um, it's like lights, camera, action just isn't happening today, but I'm making it happen. You, you see what I can either let things happen or I can make things happen. So I'm making things happen regardless of whether or not they want to or not. I'm making it happen. Okay, so let me just try out a few of my new dry erase markers on, on you bug guys. Okay, so I'm going to show you the basics of how to do... Oh, hold on, I need to find my eraser first. Oh, there it is. Okay, and the base, when you're writing with something, it's good to have something to erase with too. Erasers are a godsend. So... Let me hope that these work because these are dollar store markers. So let me see how it goes. Uh, oh, hey, it works. Okay, good. Okay, how they write. Oh, excellent. All right, so let me give you the basics of starting your own cartoon, which is like your basic shapes, your triangle, your square, your circle, and what I like to call the plasma. It can be whatever shape you want it to be. And you can have whatever you want it to have in it. <laughs> Just a weird, odd, whatever you want to call it, shape, whatever. That makes it fun for everybody. And then, you know, if you've been practicing for a while with me, you know that I like to get you going with uh, drawing faces and eyes and nose, mouth and stuff like that. And then I've been showing you guys the basics of how to get a cartoon going with the, the basic squares to get you making your own cartoons. Yeah. Da -da -da -da. See, all right, so you can't stop me from doing what I enjoy. So there we go. So basically, I, I want to get you guys going, and I got to get myself going, really, actually. I, the way I, the reason I do this mostly is just to push myself to just, you know, I know what I'm heading towards, and I just, I got to go that way. I can't just wait for it to happen. I have to make it happen for myself, right? Because nobody can do it for me. Like, nobody can show you the door. Uh, I can show you the door, but I can't make you go through it. It's something that you have to go on, and it's a journey that I go on with myself, too. So, no problem. And we are all going through this uh, electric word called life together, and I appreciate it. And you know what? It, if anything, I always tell people, you want to get good at something. The main thing is practice. Practice, practice, practice. I can't, I can't tell you guys enough. I've done it all my life. I've been practicing, practicing. I hope one day I can do like the real deal for somebody one day. Maybe uh, get that an opportunity to show you guys, you know, I am more than just like this fleshy puppet that you see before you. I actually do have more value inside this little nugget in my brain than I, you know, than I let on. So, but you know what? I try to keep it. I keep, I try to keep myself humble. I try to keep kind and I try to keep out of the way of other people because, <laughs> you know, if you can do it better than I can, you go ahead and you do it. I am so always so proud of all the people that I know that have gone ahead and done it for themselves. So now I'm going to show you. I got a blue one here. Let's see how this blue looks. 
blue looks very blue. All right, excellent. So that blue marker. I also have a purple marker. Ooh, purple. Oh, look at that. Prince would be so happy. Did I tell you I met Prince once? Yeah, you've probably heard the story. Yes, I have met Prince once. This is a dark blue. So let's see. Dark. It looks like the same color. <laughs> Dark blue looks the same as the blue. That doesn't very much different. Okay, it's the cap color mostly. And the purple, that's like the in-between. I got two black, and I have one that is pinky red. It is like a pinky red. So I guess I'll just call it pink. Like a pink. All right, see? Got some colors going on. Exclamation. <laughs> How you doing? Okay, I hope this is showing up because, uh, you know, all you're going to get is like a black screen if, if this doesn't show up. So <laughs> pink, red. All right. The red looks good. And last but not least is my favorite color of all time. Do you guys know what my favorite color is? I can't hear you. What is it? Yeah, my last name's Overholt. And because I like everything that starts with the letter O, my favorite color is orange. <laughs> and look at that orange color. All right. So we're going to be able to make some really cool things. In the upcoming days and, and stuff as I'm making stuff and trying to discover what I can do to get you guys interested in doing more cartooning. Because I love cartooning. And like I say, I have a second marker here, which is another black one. And that one works really nicely too. All right. So we got some good markers to get you going. Oh, and I also have one. Oh, oh yeah, I did it already. I did it. Red, red and pink. Right. <laughs> I'll be fine. Anyways, I just want to say hello. Thank you for tuning in. And I don't know if this is coming through or not, but I hope to God that you guys have a fantastic day. And like I say, you know more about what I do, look me up. And if you want to hire me for doing any kind of commission pieces, I'm doing, I'm taking, uh, you know, you know, I'm taking commissions right now as we speak. I, I got a couple of things going on in the background behind me, uh, working on, um, uh, working on paintings and stuff like that for, for myself. Cause I think it's best if you want to invest in something, invest in yourself. Yes. And in that note, <laughs> peace out, brother, with a little bit added, as my mama used to say, I want to keep it short and sweet today because I love you guys. And it's a beautiful day outside. It's supposed to be a beautiful week. And I'll come in and say hello every once in a while. But you guys got to get up, got to gotta get out for yourselves and enjoy this day. So have a glorious day, you guys. Uh, peace out, brother, with a little bit added, as my mama used to say. And uh, yeah, I hope you like my videos. Check them out if you haven't had a chance to. I would uh, suggest, you know, if you want to really have a good time, a, a look at my uh, 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 Hyperactive is a hilarious one. And my China Girl is pretty funny. And so is my uh, California Dreaming of Brad Pitt. So I hope you like them all. And if you have any questions or any concerns or anything else you want to tell me, let me know in the comments below. Follow me and learn something about uh, cartooning and, and all the great nuances of being an artist in the Niagara area. Yes. All right. And with that, <laughs> and I say me and Brad Pitt, this is me over here. Yeah. He loves me to pieces. I can tell already. <laughs> right. All right. Well, we're having fun with that. And I appreciate you guys being here. And on that note, let me just say so long and I'll see you again real soon.